since everybody keeps asking me how I wrap my wraps, I'm going to show you right now me wrapping something up and show you how I wrap it. So let's get digged in so you know how to do it as well. So first you get your delicious desired food. Next you get your wraps. These are the wraps I use. You get them on spaces on the web, .co.uk. Banging, 12 inches as well. Obviously it wouldn't be the same without a wrap slap, so let's go. So to start off we're going to go the chips, just because I like chips. And I've actually not got a lot of chips, but I don't need a lot of chips. And we're going with this stuff, it's going to be like rice and mincy stuff. So I'll put that one down and I'll come back. Right, so there it is, before we start with it, I'm going to tell you some sweet pro tip of mine. You want to keep it centred in the middle and hopefully keep these wee bits to the side here because trust me it helps. I don't know how I'm going to get to show you how to do it, but I'm going to try somehow. So wait a minute, let's try this. Right, so this is probably about the best angle I can get to show you. But imagine you're doing this for kind of like this end. So first of all, you want to grab the two sides of the sexy boy, like this. Right, sometimes you need to get a wee kind of flap up and move it a bit. Right, so you get the kind of base shape of the wrap. Then, you right, pull on each side like this. Okay, you can get a wee square sometimes, that's better. And you just lift it and fold it like this. Okay. Squeeze in the side bits. Make sure it's all nice and tucked. And then you pull these side bits in like this and here. It's always a favourite of mine to do that. And then when you do that, keep squeezing in here while you're rolling it, like so. And get a wee kind of tuck. And as you go, and there you go. There's a wee open bit there, but that's why you just push that in. And there you go. There it is. Big just a bad boy. Just like that. And as always, when you get it like this, we're just going to stick it right in the German, and I'll show you the outcome. Here we go. Also, a tip here as well. I don't actually put the top bit down. Um, I just kind of use the bottom bit and like go each side individually. It just seems to work better. I don't know why. And of course, you need your famous scuba do plate. Now, it does not make sense. And then, as you see, as it starts to smoke, that's when I flip it. So you just flip that. And you go, get a push, a squeeze, and you go. And then there you go, you've made yourself a delicious wrap guard wrap. Let's get it cut open so you can see the outcome of what's inside. I'm not actually too used to filming for Facebook, so I don't really know how this looks, but I just hope it's good enough for you. So this is how it looks right now. Always the juicy bit. And then we cut it with a big sword. Oh, this is I go too close to my fingers. I feel there's a crunchy chip in that, so... You know, sawing for that one. Big knife. I'm not going to like it, don't worry. And then... There you go. You have made yourself a wrap called wrap. Well, I did. So... It's one of the chips at the end, so it's kind of making it a wee bit flappy, but that's fine. And then the taste test. Hopefully it tastes good. And I uh, appreciate you watching. Hopefully, I know you can make yourself a wrap god wrap. Cheers. Delicious. Very, very good. And hopefully, I've not made you too hungry. But, now you know. And it's here for you to go and watch. Mm. I'm going to go and enjoy this. Thanks for watching the tutorial, and uh, you go rock. I'll see you in the next one.